Bonjour. Yes? Gabriel, what about arranging a dance performance? Not unless you can do something new. Don't frown. You need inspiration, Mata. Taxi? Where to, madame? Garde du Nord, please. At your service, madame. Hello there. May I help you? Take it too. Madrid. The Eagle, please. What an interesting gesture. Hello there. Destination? Take it to... Paris, please. Excuse me. Bonjour. Are you looking very satisfied today? And with good reason. I have a new dance idea. Please demonstrate. What do you think? Superb, my dear. Then I can stage a performance? That's amazing! I'll prepare the theatre for another triumph. No, Gabriel. This one is destined for Berlin. What can I say? If you insist, I approve. That was exquisite! What a performance! Hello, Mercedes. Merci beaucoup. 
Ludi doesn't care for dancing, but wait till I tell him. Let's not tell him anything. Ludi may be a fine young man, but he may just be after your money, and you're so young. What? Your wise and loving father has asked me to bring you home. That stodgy old man? Never! Damn! Berlin 24201, please. Hello, Mercedes. Matter again. Well, goodbye, Mercedes. I just wanted to hear your voice. Taxi? Where to, Fraulein? Spandau Station, bitte. At your service, Fraulein. Hello there. May I help you? Ticket to... Paris, please. Taxi? Where to, madame? Police station, please. Let's go. Captain, I'm here to ask you a favor. What's the matter? If you want Zollinger, you need to help me threaten someone. Marta, how vicious. She's just a runaway girl, and her father wants her back. I want you to write out an arrest warrant for her no-good boyfriend. On what grounds? Alienation of affection, transport across international borders, false imprisonment, I don't know. Eh bien, false imprisonment sounds serious. Name? Oh dear, I'm not sure. I need a name. Taxi? Where to, madame? Gare du Nord, please. At your service, madame. Hello there. May I help you? Take it to... Berlin. The rocket, please. Berlin 24201, please. Hello, Mercedes. Matter again. Come to Paris and bring your friend. Oh, and by the way, what's his name? Right. 
Ludi, Ludwig Engelbright. I'm sure he's wonderful. See you soon. Taxi? Where to, Fraulein? Spandau Station, bitte. Here we go. Hello there. What city, please? Ticket to... Paris. The Express, please. Excuse me. Yes? Gabriel, what about arranging a dance performance? Not unless you can do something new. Don't frown. You need inspiration, Mata. Taxi? Where to, madame? Police station, please. Please, get in. Captain, I'm here to ask you a favor. What's the matter? His name is Ludwig Engelbright. All right, done. Here, it's not quite official, just in case, but it will scare an ordinary citizen. Merci. Hello, Mercedes. Marta? Meet Ludi. Hello. What's your business here in Paris? A dance performance, maybe? Your father asked me to reason with you. He worries about you. Oh, he doesn't know the first thing. Stay at home, Mercedes. War is coming, blah, blah. I'm no longer daddy's little girl. I'm grown up now. So there is no chance to convince you of returning to Monaco. Of course not. This is no joke, Mercedes. Captain Ladoux will arrest Ludi if you don't go home. He'll never see the light of day again. That's terrible. Isn't it? For Ludi's sake. All right. I'll go. Ludi will just have to follow me. Promise? Promise. Taxi? Where to, madame? Gare du Nord, please. Let's go. Hello there. Uh, destination? Ticket to... Monaco, please.
hotel for sale. May I speak with you? Martha, good morning. Good news. I met Mercedes in Paris, and she agreed to come home. Yes, I know. She's already here. I don't know how you did it, but I'm eternally grateful. My limousine is at your command. Vielen Dank. No. I don't have time to laze around. Taxi? Where to, ma'am? Train station, please. Please, get in. Hello there. Where to? Ticket to... The Express, Paris, please. Taxi? Where to, madame? Police station, please. Please, get in. I'd like to see Monsieur Samsonet, please. Go ahead. You know the way. Enchanté. Matt, you look exhausted. Any progress? I think I have everything I need. Not quite. There's one last task. Go see Shradmula. She'll explain. Taxi? Where to, madame? Gare du Nord, please. Let's go! Hello there. May I help you? Take it to... Monaco, please. May I speak with you? Hello there. Elspeth, I'm worried. What's on your mind? Haber gave me his pass to Zollinger's factory, but the seal is broken. It's useless. Don't worry about that right now. You still have other things to prepare first. I have got this costume, but I wonder who I'll fool. Unless they see Haber regularly, I'd think everybody. Jelinek has promised me the use of a limousine whenever I want one, but I don't see any around. 
He keeps a whale-sized automobile right here in Monte Carlo. It comes and goes. Harbour's Pass isn't going to work. That's where you're wrong. Oscar cast a seal from that soap impression you stole. Your first mission, remember? Zollinger's Sigil. How could I forget? I'll just warm it up and reseal your pass. There. You've got everything you need. Now it's all up to you. Whoa. Stage fright. Break a leg. Well, now. Your pass looks valid. Signed, sealed. Perfect. I love proper paperwork. Herr Dr. Haber, this is unexpected. What brings you here? I was reviewing my calculations and suddenly realized we've made a dangerous mistake. Mistake? I don't understand. And what's happened to your voice? Oh, terrible cold. I left my bed to warn you. What do you mean? I've made a mistake, Zollinger. My reagent proportions are all wrong. So far, we've avoided disaster, but our luck won't last. What do you mean? What disaster? We've never had the smallest leak. I mean an explosion. Kaboom, sir! Mon Dieu! You're sure about this? Fatally sure. Now, show me the controls, stand aside and let me go to work. Please, be my guest. Over there. Change the combination again. All green now. I had no idea what this means, but it sounds important. I'll make a note of it in my diary. Displays and gauges. I can't do anything with it. Wait. There are instructions beneath the gauges. Setting up operation. One, switch on pump. Two, open pump valve. Three, Adjust gas proportions. 4. Launch process by activating mixer control. I think the pump is running. We have pressure. These must be the controls Harbor told me. goes. This is it. The master control panel for the manufacturing of poison gas. So, what do I have to do? I must activate the pumps for the three basic elements, connect them to the main boiler and last but not least, set the critical mixture ratio, and then I should probably get into safety in a timely manner.
that did it. Harper, what have you done? I don't know. I can't correct the formula. Can't correct it? What? Of course you can. You must. Wait. Wait. You are not Harbour? Who are you? Goodbye, Rupert. Matahan. I'll kill you for this. As you killed Brunel? You damned whore! No! No! Zollinger's ideas are too clever to disappear forever. Others will continue his quest for the perfect weapon. Meanwhile, we've stopped something terrible from becoming much worse. I call that a good dance. Well, Oscar. We didn't stop history, but we did improve it. All right, you, you're free to go. My advice is leave France. In a war, no one is safe. Not you, madame. You promised me Zollinger. Zollinger is dead. Oui, oui, c'est vrai. For that and for many other little courtesies, you have my gratitude. But I can't prosecute a dead man. So, eh bien, for you I have a gift. And what is that? You are under arrest. Mata. Blanks? Your squad fired blanks. The most I could do. Quite a handsome gift after all. Yes, now that you're dead, you're a free woman. Testing, testing, are we rolling? Okay. Now then, dear lady, since our last conversation, I've done some digging, and I unearthed a death certificate for one Elspeth Schragmuller, dated 1934. Oh, dear me. Care to explain? You're sure about this? There's no doubt. Poor Elspeth. Many think she was the real spy, the one who taught me my trade. That's right. As you have guessed, once upon a time, I was Mata Hari. I knew it. I wonder, who will publish a claim that I survived? When I look back, spying seems like another life. I was nervous at first, but I kept my wits and during my missions uncovered many other evil plots and schemes. Who knows? They may have been my most important exploits. Being a spy was hard work, all those tricks and pitfalls. I quite enjoyed them. I suppose, without knowing it, I had a knack. Everything is so quiet and peaceful now, I miss the turmoil, the uncertainty, the sudden insights. You may think I did everything for money, although that's not really true. How I loved to dance. It paid as well as espionage, and it was almost as exciting.
After the war, I sailed for America. There, in the company of a gentleman friend you may have heard of, I settled in Pasadena, California. Those Hollywood starlets never guessed who their dance teacher really was. <laughs>